Okay, so this is going to be a tutorial. It's not a tutorial right now. I'm showing you what I'm going to be working on. Now, this is going to be a biling art. It's going to be a piece. But we have a special guest star here. We have uh, Michael Bisping, who's the current middleweight champion for UFC. I think he did okay. Two, six, UFC 216, 217. So, uh, you know, he's pretty badass. I wanted to put, I wanted to put him in there. And the, the thing that's going to be, it's going to be Bai Ling as a ring girl. So um, what exactly is that going to be? It's going to be a 3D pop-up art. And I'm going to show you some samples. So, of course, for this stuff we're using, you know, as I've shown before for the last piece, it's going to be, you know, uh, color construction paper, all the different colors. I have a whole bunch more. So um, look back to how to draw by Ling number, the number six series, and you'll see all the different uh, kinds of uh, paper I'm using. So I've done some samples of the type of art I want to see, show by Ling as. Now, here is one. Um, this is a bowl. Uh, it says smash through the obstacles. This is like a little greeting card. And you can see the little, um, how the bricks kind of stick out. They're like little folded paper, like origami almost, okay? This head kind of wobbles and wobbles and wobbles, but you get the idea. It's like a, a bull crashing through the brick wall. Um, this is a pig, uh, dirty up your boxed in life, kind of just take chances. You can see the triangular legs. You can see the, the snout and the ears and the little legs coming out. So um, I base these on, these little greeting cards on uh, the Chinese zodiac animals. Um, this one is don't stop for anything. This is a clock, so it kind of sticks out the sides, the head and the paw sticks out. Uh, it's part drawing, part uh, painting, part uh, cut out shapes. You can see the, the uh, tail. This floor, I didn't like this floor. It's just lopsided, but you see a checkerboard floor. Um, so the, the thing I focused more on was a little bit of the ears and the legs hind legs. Uh, this one's a dog. This is a dog with a snout. You don't really see his eyes. It's a shiny gold bone. Uh, protect what is precious. So uh, you can see his feet. You can see his legs. You can see the mouth from different angles. That's what it's about. And what else? Oh, yes, we got two more. Actually, three more because it's uh, we got the monkey which is reach for the highest goal. So um, I think I could have done this a lot better, but you see the, um, in here, you can see the coconut. The coconuts are in different angles. You can see underneath the palm tree. So when you look at it, it has a more like 3D perspective. And the kind of palm trees kind of sticks out, but not that much. And then we have a uh, dragon. And it says, juggle between fantasy and reality, this red apple meaning reality, and this apple meaning fantasy. Kind of looks like the, um, the computer apple, but that's sort of what I have. And there's uh, the dragon's mouth and his horns. And, you know, I had the shapes popping out of the rectangle just to kind of give it more of a life than just having to conform within the rectangle. So these are the, the samples of pop-up art. And here's, I think I've shown this already before, but I've never shown the entire... Well, I've shown the entire piece, but this is uh, sort of another thing. Uh, this is rosemary uh, pop-up art, you know, using construction paper. She just kind of stands out the way she does. Got an airplane going by for some idiotic reason, but that's okay. If you can hear me over the airplane, fantastic. And there's the balloon. So going back to this piece, um, this is the piece. So this is Michael Bisping minus the eye and the arms. I got a little bit of his tattoo in there, a lot of swirls. I was trying to do the tap out logo here, but it's, I'm using white out, but it's way too hard because it's a brush. Got the Nike swoosh, got the uh, boxers. Uh, he's wearing uh, sort of a navy blue trunks. And um, what I want to do is based on the way I've drawn by Ling in the first six, I'm going to have Bai Ling here. I'm going to have the UFC logo here. And then I'm going to have Bai Ling in sort of that pop-out imagery. So 
I want her to her head, her neck, her shoulders, her breasts, her legs, her thighs to stick out and um you know it's gonna it's gonna look like a 3D image popping out. I gotta flatten this because you see it's kind of curved. I'm gonna have to put some books down and really flatten this out because it's not I don't really like it the way it is. But I'm trying to use less glue. Uh I spent all last night trying to get the um the chain link fence look. The thing is, this is a dark gray paper, and um, it's, you know, it's black. You know, when you go, when you watch any octagon UFC fight, you know, whether it's uh, the preliminaries or the pay-per-view, um, it's always black, black on black. Uh, there's usually logos for games, food, snacks, cars, whatever. And you put that on the, on the, um, on the top, on the cushion on the top. Forget, if I don't know my terminology for certain things in UFC, forgive me. But yeah, I mean, for the for the 3D pop-up Im imagery, I mean, you definitely want to put like an origami version of Bai Ling. So the next video you'll see, I'm going to show you the head and neck and kind of showing you the beginning. These are going to be very short videos because this is a very lengthy one. And if you've seen the, the number six... Uh, drawing of Bai Ling, you kind of have an idea of how I did all this, you know, you know, with the scissors and the glue and getting the shapes right so that I can get this design that I wanted. I used a black crayon for the background to have a little bit of a painted background um, just to make it kind of generic, to make it simple, because really the focus is on Bai Ling and Bisping. I chose Bis Michael Bisping because it kind of rhymed with Bai Ling and because he's the current champion right now. Um, until he's not. Everybody falls at some point. So uh, let's just see what happens. Um, and I'll make another video tomorrow.